Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But now let's talk about our good old friend Pepe. You know, shout out to the Pepe community for showing tremendous amount of love. I love each and every one of you guys. Continue supporting and you will see a continuation of these updates. But looking at Pepe, it's down about 3.5% and I know, I know there's going to be some people coming out and say, why is Pepe down? Come on, guys, let's really understand what's happening with the broader market. And let's also understand how much Pepe has gone up over the course of the last one week. Up 36% on the weekly time frame. And on the monthly time frame, it's up 44.3%. Now, a lot of people tend to forget that. And um, this is why I'm here, to give you guys a continuous reminder as to what's really happening. And you know, you're looking at the broader market, seeing a little bit of a minor pullback. Um, looking at the price of Pepe, currently sitting at 1088 still, four zeros in front of the price. Down 3.5% in all three comparatives, USD, Bitcoin, or ETH. Market cap is at about $4.6 billion, and the 24-hour trading volume is at about $1.8 billion. But before we get into any further, as always, just a quick disclaimer, anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto. So looking at the overall meme coin uh, market valuation, as far as you know, the entire meme coin market is concerned, it's currently sitting at $54.6 billion. And, you know, I've been talking to some people within the community. Some people are projecting that, you know, this number could actually hit $100 billion. And some people are going to come out and say, you know, that's just absolutely crazy to think about. But what I, what I want you guys to remember is we almost hit, I think, $70 billion at the peak in the March. So... Again, if a Bitcoin hits an all-time high, anything is possible. So as far as your meme coins are concerned, if you follow the channel on a regular basis, we saw a little bit of a head start for the big boys. And when I say big boys, I mean Dogecoin, Chiba Inu, and Pepe. When the market was starting to go uh, you know, bullish again, we started to see these three coins specifically have a head start. And um, you know, right now, these three coins are actually lagging behind you know, the top 10, majority of the top 10. Um, you know, Pepe is down about 2.9%, but you know, that's part of the game. Uh, we are seeing the broader market seeing a little bit of minor retracement. And you know, when I talk about the broader uh, coins, you do tend to notice that these coins are in the bigger uh, you know, market valuation projects. You guys can see Dogecoin's rank 9, Shiba is 15, and Pepe is 27. So these are considered big coins, if you want to put, the, put it out that way. So they do react more you know, to Bitcoin rather than some of these other coins that, you know, can outpace. Because right now, how you want to look at it is, even though we have seen Bitcoin see a little bit of a minor pullback, you're still in a bull trend. We're in a bullish uh, upwards trajectory as far as the bigger picture is concerned. Um, and, you know, smaller cap coins tend to, you know, actually outpace even a little bit of retracement. Bigger coins, of course, manipulation is the key. There's whales that are obviously, you know, manipulating the price. Obviously, futures platform. Those are factors that a lot of people don't realize and that needs to be realized. As far as Bitcoin dominance is concerned, it's pulling down. Um, and, you know, that is very interesting. But I did mention this in one of my other updates that, you know, this number can go up in a snap. So, you know, let's not get too excited. Uh, as far as, you know, Bitcoin price is concerned, we're seeing a little of an uptick we are sitting below sixty four thousand uh, dollars but i don't think that you know it's going to have a hard time pushing back up to these levels uh, but let's see what happens as far as you know holder count goes two hundred eighty eight thousand four hundred and six you're seeing an increase uh, in holders and that is of course really nice to see as far as the price is concerned we are seeing a very very similar price pattern with the price of bitcoin and what i mean by that is look at bitcoin from september 6th and look at, you know, Pepe from September 6th. You're seeing a very similar pattern. You saw a monthly high for Pepe at 11.94. You saw a monthly high for Bitcoin at 66.47. Saw a retracement. Pepe reacted to that retracement. Bitcoin went up. Pepe went up. So a very, very strong correlation currently. And, you know, Pepe is picking up traction, but of course now as the price is breaking out, we are facing some key, and yes, I repeat, key resistance. But if this key resistance is able to break out, which I think it will not have a hard time doing so, I think another potential, you know, monthly high could be in play. But I shouldn't even say monthly high, you know, we're approaching October 1st, so, um, you know, we could be sitting at higher levels, um, you know, compared to what we were at just a few days back. So I like what I'm seeing, of course. Uh, we do have some significant amount of resistance, which obviously we need to break out. If we do, I think a potential retest up to those July highs could be in play. But let me know down below what you guys think. 
What are your personal projections? A lot of people already, and again, this is not my opinion. I do believe that, you know, Pepe is one of the biggest. There's no argument about that. And I still do believe Pepe has, you know, brought in, you know, a very unique narrative for the meme coins. Um, and uh, I think, without a doubt, it is one of the biggest meme coins currently and could even take over Shiba Inu's spot. But with that said... Um, you know, I don't want to make any predictions whether or not we're going to see uh, Pepe here in the next three to four years. Maybe it will be here, um, depending where it goes in terms of, you know, valuation. Of course, some people with the Pepe community are going to come out and say, yes, it is going to be there. But again, obviously, time is going to tell. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys personally think regarding that. That's what I want to know. Which meme coins do you think are blue chip meme coins? Let me know in the comments down below. Love each and every one of you guys. We'll see you tomorrow in Crypto ZX and peace out.